he said it was like a sonic boom. <clears throat> loud, very loud. Leslie Cheatham's husband woke her up and they saw flames outside their Bedford, New Hampshire home right across the Merrimack River from the Manchester Boston Regional Airport. But this was concerning, very concerning. I mean, this close to home, yeah. It was scary. They soon learned it was a small plane crash just outside their window that went into the woods and on the banks of the Merrimack River just after 11.30 last night. Authorities say the pilot reported engine trouble shortly before the crash and did not make it to the runway. There was a occupant, a single occupant uh, in the aircraft that was deceased. And you can see the investigators on scene taking a very close look. Fortunately, they have daylight hours to see what happened here when this plane crashed and from what people describe, exploded. This video from across the river at night as emergency boats responded in the water and crews arrived from throughout the area as nearby neighbors hurried to see what happened. I couldn't believe it, so I kept telling myself maybe it's something else, but my dad was adamant on us telling, or telling us that it was a plane crash. The pilot of the twin engine turboprop was identified as 23-year-old Emmanuel Von Volakis of Linden, Michigan, flying medical supplies from Essex County, New Jersey. We hate to see the loss of life uh, in, in any sort of um, situation like this, and we feel for the family. I mean, it's very sad, especially this time of year. Medical examiner will do an autopsy to confirm the identification, and the NTSB is investigating the crash. In Bedford, New Hampshire, Josh Brogadier, WCVB News Center 5.